Gets it back. Di Natale. Gets good distance on it. And it's Mores. Ball shows there will be three extra minutes. Plays it out to the wing. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Final action of the first half. So in they come for the break with nothing to separate them. The score 1 1. Wurzburg get the ball rolling in the second half. Going for goal! A great save, real class. Oh, much more than a, than a routine save for me, and, and yet he just coped with, with room to spare. the best of headers they're committing a lot of men forward at the start of this second half they know that this is an important time for them now Paulinho Fuchs tries a long pass towards the front Di Natale Chip through. It's a promising ball. Can he find a finish now? <laughs> the defence can get it clear. Fuchs to get it forward quickly. Looks to slip it through. Really well taken goal. And the game is well and truly turned on its head. Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier.
Arsenal have a sub ready to come on. Pandev. Paulinho. Aimed long and direct. Now it's Pandev. Pandev plays it into the channel. Shot at goal! Oh, just couldn't quite turn it in. Arsenal had players queuing in the box in that situation, and they've still got nothing to show for it. What a complete and utter waste. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Di Natale. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's... Well, that's a foul. A simple decision for the referee. Tune his range finder before the next one. Paulinho. Pandev is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, and they finally reacted, but they could have been more switched on before he, he scored. It's a fabulous position. Pumps it upfield. Arsenal may be thinking about substitutions now. They still have two available. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Kazri battles to win it back. Looks to thread it through. Well, shell pass, that's the message there. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Done very well to intervene. Adenor. Paulinho. And it's Kasri. Di Natale. the ball through, the shot's on! Good running with the ball, can they build on it? And he's got the ball glued to his feet. And he's there to hoof it away. Good challenge, he just stood firm.
That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Oh, good interception. Di Natale passes it through. He's in, surely! They've done it! There seemed no way back, but they are level! Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. And that's what the game is all about. Find space and finish, but we have to credit the pastor to pick him out. This is quite a battle. Well, that goal just serves to give them the momentum and psychological edge now at this stage, but for me, they've got to chase a winner. Just five minutes left. Kazri. Balls out on the left now. Looks like a good ball through. Würzburg have a free kick. Plays it out to the flank. Kazri. And it's Fuchs. Fuchs with a long pass out wide. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Tries to get it forward quickly. Thrust towards the front line. Will be a throw in. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Gets it back. Who's going to make this theirs? And that's that. Passion and panache and perseverance and, in the end, parity. A really good game to watch. How would you summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim? I think they'll be a little irked by the fact that they had control for good periods of the game and didn't do enough to turn that control into victory. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.